Hey y'all, this is Jeremy at Parkside Kia. Thank you so much for checking out our video. This is the 2021 Seltos. We're really excited about this car. Uh, we've, for years we've had the Soul and we've had the Sportage. And this is a blend in the middle of those two cars in a great segment that uh, it's the best all-wheel drive in America in this, uh, in this value here. Check this out. We've got our fog light. This is the SX trim level. So it's loaded out everything you can do to a Seltos. We've got our triple fog lights on both sides. This diamond pattern repeats in a couple of different places throughout the car. Very stylish. Of course, you've got the Kia Tiger Nose grille here. And also, that Tiger Nose grille repeats up here on top. So that's our, our Kia signatures right there. Come on over here. I'll let you see the uh, alloy wheels. A lot of folks don't know this, but alloy wheels actually are a safety feature because it keeps the air flowing over your rotors and brakes. So it's a really nice touch that you can get alloy wheels on this car. This is all-wheel drive as well. Most of the Seltos come in all-wheel drive. The safety features on this are absolutely loaded. We've got blind spot, lane keep assist, highway driving assist, uh, got your backup camera, Bluetooth, uh, onboard navigation. I'm going to show you some more stuff inside here in just a second, okay? All right, one of the things that you get with Seltos is the push button start. Really nice feature where you just get in, you don't have to pull the key out of the pocket. You just walk up, push the touch locks on the outside and you're in. Get your air controls here. I'll lower that so the microphone's not picking up all that air. On screen, check this out. You got the touch screen. This is the 10 and, 10 and a quarter inch screen here. You got the pinch zoom. So if you need to take a long trip or look around, you can zoom out. Lots of cool features inside of our navigation. Got your Cirrus XM radio here. Just sign that up. Your weather widget is awesome here. You've got your, your uh, today's forecast, and then also you can touch your five-day forecast. You can uh, change where you're at. If you're traveling, you can change what you know where you want the weather to be. Awesome feature there. And over here, we've got our HD radio data. So you've got traffic information, Doppler radar, fuel price. Check this out. This is live right now. So here we're in Knoxville. And of course, it's raining up in the Smokies because that's what it does up there. So you can look around and see where the rainstorms are at for you. Fuel price is an awesome feature here. You'll never pay too much for fuel again. You'll always know just by touching. And, I, and I, the cool thing about this, a lot of times people say, well, I've got that information on my phone. Well, that's true, but do you want to look all that up while you're driving? You're on a trip, you're not familiar with the area, you can just touch on screen right here. You need, are you out of gas right now? You need the closest gas station? No, I've got a little bit more gas. Let's go to the price. So here, here's the cheapest gas within about 15 miles. There's 11 miles away. So the fuel, I love, I love the, fuel, uh, the fuel checker there for price. Voice memo is a nice touch here. So you're driving down the road, you have an idea for a business meeting, grocery list to do. You can just drop a little note to yourself on screen and you can record a voice memo. Nice little feature there. So a couple of things that we have in here, we've got the Bose upgraded premium sound. So you got Bose surround speakers in here. You've got the uh, LED lighting up top. We've got UVO. Lots of cool features inside of UVO. UVO is short for your voice. And uh, lots of cool things that you can do inside UVO. Down here, we've got your wireless phone charging. You just lay your phone up here. The, the light will light up here next to the emblem and let you know that you're engaged. Down here in the center USB, you can plug in your phone. And it doesn't matter, Android or uh, Apple. Your Android Auto and Apple CarPlay will light up depending on what kind of phone you have. And then you've got your apps, your music, podcast, uh, your navigation. If you like to use Waze or Google Maps, however you like it, you can plug it in through Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. Uh, down here, we've got our drive modes. And you can change uh, on screen here. We've got sport, normal, and smart. This changes how the transmission behaves. So you've got the different shift points. So in sport, you're going to be hitting those shift points a little bit quicker. Really nice feature there. And also creature comforts, we got heated seats on both sides. And with this being an all-wheel drive, uh, Kia uses the same all-wheel drive system called Dynamax. And how that works is it's, it's running on front-wheel drive, 
95% of the time, if it feels it, if it needs it, it will engage all four wheels if it's feeling slip. So you've got that safety behind you that, hey, I know that, that you know, I'm not going to slip. Uh, if you are below 20 miles an hour and you're like on snow, ice, gravel, somewhere where you, you know, you know that you're going to get some slip, you can go ahead and hit your all-wheel drive lock button down here and hold that in. Uh, now keep in mind the all the all-wheel drive system is not intended for high highway speeds okay it's it's low and slow but you'll definitely get the grip that you're you're looking for with this Here in the back seat, a couple things that people ask, will I have room? Will my passengers have room? I'm an average size guy. I'm not, not overly tall and I'm not too short. I've got plenty of leg room here and I've got my armrest here in the middle and cup holders. Cool thing back here, you have your air vents. Sometimes when you have a, you know, a, a car that's not a full size SUV, they won't have air vents back here and your passengers are waiting on the air to come back. You don't have that problem in the Seltos. We've got air vents right here for you. You also have rear charging with the USB and then a little uh, cubby hole here. And you've got your uh, map holder here as well. If you've got car seats in your life, say, uh, you know, Kia is very big on safety. We've got the locks here, the metal latching for the car seats, and then also in the back, the attachment points on the back for you. Here in the back, you've got plenty of cargo space. A couple of things here. One is if you've got your eggs, or bread, something that's light and you don't want uh, to be damaged by stuff rolling around in the back. Just put your lighter stuff up here. If you don't have anything up here, you just grab this. Pop that up there real easy. And then you've got open access to the back. Check this out in here. You've got two levels of cargo back here. So if you want a level surface, leave this shelf just like this. If you need more room, you pop this down. Get that extra space up here it's a nice nice feature and down in here i'll pick that back up you've got plenty of room in here with your spare tire kit you've got plenty of room in here for uh jumper cables flashlight first aid kit whatever it is that you like to keep uh, uh your emergency roadside speaking of that we have five years with kia you get five years roadside assistance awesome awesome benefit of buying a kia and back here i'm going to lower this back Got our handle here. There's your backup camera right here. I'm going to show you one cool thing that Kia does. A lot of times in a rainstorm, you'll have rain running over the lens. If you've ever been in a car and you've known that aggravation, you know exactly what I'm talking about. With Kia, the backup camera is underneath this ledge here. So the rain comes down, drips straight down instead of running over the lens. It's a small thing, but when you need that camera backing up in the rain, it's a big thing. Another cool feature that Seltos comes with in the EX and the SX trim level is remote start. Right here on the fob, you don't have to have an extra uh, smaller fob like you've seen with other cars. Just right there on the side. Just lock it up and then give it a hold for about 10 seconds. And your car will be ready for you when you walk outside in the wintertime or in the summertime. You get that air going or get that heat going for you. Another cool feature that Kia has brought to the marketplace is called Rear Occupant Alert. Rear occupant alert is where you have locked the car and you've walked away. And we hear too often on the news horrible stories, honestly, of a child or a pet that has been locked in a car. And so Kia wanted to do something to fix that. So they've created rear occupant alert. There are sensors in the roof back here. And if the car is locked up, and there's motion in the back. So we're thinking about a pet or a baby in a car seat, something similar to that. If there's motion, the car is gonna go into panic. So the horn, the lights are gonna start going off and get somebody in the parking lot to come look and see what's going on inside the car. You'll also get an update on your app through the UVO. That was one of the cool features I mentioned a minute ago was the UVO. Through the UVO app on your phone, you'll get a notification 
that there's movement in the car and alert you to come back and check on that. So we, we want to do our part as an industry to prevent one of the, the most tragic things that happens in cars is babies and pets being left, uh, left in cars accidentally. Here up front, I'll show you a couple of things that we really like about our Kias. This rubber strip here, again, it's a small thing, but it's a big thing. This rubber strip here prevents airflow from going underneath the hood and creating vibration in the hood. You usually have to go into uh, luxury type vehicles to find this kind of a feature, but it's an awesome thing that Kia brings to the marketplace. So you'll notice the quieter ride that you get, less rattle, less wind noise. Inside here, a couple of cool things that I like about the engine. There's your washer fluid, your radiator fluid, and your brake fluid. Notice all these containers are clear. You can look right in and you can see just by glancing do I need to check my fluids. Your uh, oil is just filled on top, real simple, real easy, and your engine oil uh, dipstick is right up front. You're not having to reach over anything uh, and it's, it's easy to maintain uh, on your own. I always like to talk about our warranties. Kia, of course, has the best warranties in the industry. We've got our five-year, 60,000-mile comprehensive warranty that covers just about everything on here except the wearables. Very, very, very full warranty. Then we have our 10-year, 100,000-mile powertrain warranty. So we're talking about the engine, the transmission, and those other closed parts. Now, keep in mind, here at Parkside Kia, we have a lifetime nationwide powertrain warranty. What does that mean for you? Well, it means you're not watching the clock. I've talked with some customers who say, well, I was thinking about taking it to the Grand Canyon, but we rented a car instead because we didn't want to run up the miles on our car, which is kind of aggravating that I bought a car, I bought a nice car, I wanted to keep it, I wanted to use it, but then I'm terrified of overrunning my warranty. With our lifetime powertrain warranty, go where you want to go, take the trips you want to see, go to the beach, go see grandma, go see the Grand Canyon. So our lifetime powertrain warranty will take care of that. Y'all come on in and we'll talk about that. I'll show you on detail exactly what that means. But just keep in mind that it is a very unique product that we offer here at Parkside.